What better way to spend an afternoon than cramming into a confined space with a glam rock ukulele band? Cozy. Do you want us to feed you grapes? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes I do. <laughs> Get the grapes. Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com. And today we're speaking with the Honey Brothers. Let's have you guys all introduce yourselves first and tell us what you do in the band. I'm D.S. Posner and um, I'm in the Honey Brothers, I sing and play guitar and uh, I've been in the band since it began. I feel like a deer in the headlights right now. <laughs> uh, 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 I'm, extre I'm extremely camera shy and um, I'm Honey Ducontra and I play drums and sometimes guitar when they let me. Hey there, I'm Andrew Vladek, <laughs> and why is this so strange? I have no idea why. Is it or is it not true that you are in the Honey Brothers? It's true, I am in the Honey Brothers. I sing and I play banjo and guitar. Do you or do you not rock? I do. Let it be said. My name is Ari Gold, a.k.a. Hoyt Honey, and uh, I play ukulele. I, louder. His I play voice ukulele. Is so low, you can I barely play ukulele hear and rain uh, dance. And I do rain dances and uh, I play keyboards and I sing. Hi, uh, Dan Green, aka Sunny Honey. I am the band. <laughs> yeah. So why don't we talk about uh, what, when you guys originally got together and how the band originally formed? These, these guys uh, started the band as an acoustic trio and they used to just play um, on the streets of Manhattan and then eventually I, I came into the band and, and plugged them in and ever since then we've been rocking electric. I've heard you guys described as a glam rock ukulele band. Would you say that's accurate? With all these people defining things, we just figured we'd we'd give it a stab. I don't know how accurate we were. And we used to be called a glam rock ukulele band, and now we're, we're we call ourselves a new wave folk yeah. band. For one night, we were a goth ukulele band. Yeah, but you know these things. But generally, we are new wave folk, taking a lot of like old and traditional elements, but in, you know infusing them with lots of modern stuff. So. I would say I challenge anybody watching to come listen to us and tell us what they think we sound like. What are we? It's like a contest. It is a Maybe. contest. And a con you can have, have a contest like that. Do you think uh, ukulele will ever be mainstream? There are a lot of ukulele bands now. I'm proud to say I think we were rocking this long time. Yeah, we started playing ukulele about eight That's months true. ago. The age of the ukulele, which was, you know, back with the Portuguese sailing to <clears throat> the Marquesas, we're bringing that back and soon we're going to set sail ourselves and go on a tour and bring the ukulele back on, a, on its re-emergence for the 21st century. It's a very versatile instrument. It, it creates great rhythms and sometimes gives our songs kind of like a pulse, you know, so. A what? But, uh, a pulse. Uh, <laughs> sort of. It can be used in many different ways. He used to smash it against his head, Hoyt did, and he broke his head. Yeah, he was hospitalized one evening. One of our early club shows, I, I did break the ukulele on my head, and then when we, we do an instrument switch sometimes, which maybe you saw, so I went to the drum set and um, I think it was you. Anyway, someone pointed out, it's like, look, and like, I looked at the low tom, and there was all this blood on it, and it was dripping blood. I had no idea. Uh, blood just splattering in the air. That is terrifying. 